soup season. I love soup. And our next guest is here to show us some quick and flavorful soups that you can do at home in your pressure cooker. Super easy, super quick. And here to show us how lifestyle expert and author of Modern Pressure Cooking, Bren Herrera. Bren, thank you so much for coming Happy in again. Happy holidays. Happy holidays. Happy holidays. Happy holidays. Happy holidays. Happy holidays. Beautiful. Likewise. And, God, it smells good in here. What Thank are we you. cooking up today in the pressure so, cooker? I, was, I, I think I said earlier in the teaser it was 15 degrees when I was coming in this morning. It yes. was so cold. So when lovely Jess and I were talking about what to do for you guys, mm -hmm. I thought soups are perfect soups, because soups, it's so anything cold. Anything warm. Anything yeah. to keep the organs and the inside and the heart fluffy and, and warm. And soups can be healthier, too, which is great because you can warm up. You can feel, you know... Like you're adding some calories to your body without, you know, really putting well, on the Well, it depends on what kind of soup you're eating. If you're Fair eating enough. something that's cream-based, yeah. that's liquid-based, um, you can fill up very quickly, which mm -hmm. is good because that'll keep you from going, like, all in a dessert. The dessert and I know that food. previous segment, we they were that. talking about sugar, right? Yeah, so, so we, we want to cut back here. on sugar. So this is one of my favorite recipes in the book. It's a three-bean Say or tarragon and truffle chili oh girl. My goodness. Is that it, what we have right here? That's what we have right here. You can oh, taste while I'm over here cooking. Looks amazing. Um, yeah. It's really easy. You can use canned beans to kind of expedite the process, or you can use dry beans. It's going to take you a little longer. Okay. And what but, kind of meat do you use? So you can use turkey or beef, whatever okay. it is that you like, or you can do a combination of so pork. Any of your preference. Any of yeah. your preference. I don't eat pork, but I like a really good 80, 20 percent ground I chuck. Like that. Yeah, yeah, that's a good um, one. And then of course all of your spices. But what's really going to give this the kick is going to be the tarragon and the truffle. And that's what oil, I'm smelling. I think. And the that's totally what you're smelling. So, so you add it onto the pot? So we're, we, you always want to brown your meat because that's going to get the flavor out. So right. theoretically, this would have been browning already or that would have been getting... You um, can hear that good uh, sizzle pop that sizzle, right? Yeah. And how long does it take to make this? This particular recipe is done in 20 minutes, 20 to 25 minutes, depending on how much beef you're using. So this is... Recipe is about a pound and a half. Nice. So my hands are clean because I was just in the green room washing my hands. Oh, I trust you. Okay. Oh, so, that looks so good. So you brown that all so up. So you brown that all okay. up. Where's my wooden spoon here? Oh, here you go. I like being your assistant. I like that. I like when you're my assistant. I heard that you had a dinner party last night and you were cooking I for did. some friends. I did. I made yeah. chicken parm and homemade marinara. It was amazing. Was it? So you can do a marinara in the pressure cooker in about 10 minutes. Okay. I need to get a pressure cooker. I know. I, I got, got Justin over there. Cooker. I got Justin. Hey, Justin, honey. Justin's I got Justin. Um, he has the book and he got yes. his mama a pressure cooker for Christmas. I need to get one because last night I wanted to do a pot roast, but I didn't have time to put it in the slow cooker, so oh. I changed my recipe. No, girl. Pressure That's why I need cooker. a pressure cooker. Um, okay. So you brown the meat. Let's theoretically say that this was already brown for about, you right. know, 45 Walk minutes. you through getting that Again. beautiful finished product. So then you're going to add, um, I think we're just going to dump it all in there. This is some beef broth. You can use chicken or vegetarian. Again, for your preference. For your preference. I like that these recipes have the ability to change your dietary needs. Oh, absolutely. That's cool. So that's the flexibility. So again, the recipe in a cookbook is always a blueprint that you mm -hmm. can kind of modify for yourself according to your palate or your diet. And what other ones do we have over here as well? Because I want to make so, sure they oh, know Oh, yeah, about absolutely. Them. So I'm going to, you want to stick this here yeah, while I I'll, I'll, I'll dump this in where you got over there. So... Another recipe in the book is one of my favorites, and you can do this in the electric pressure cooker. The, the advantage of the stovetop pressure cooker is that it's over direct heat, so you're going to cook in less cooking time. Yeah. But the electric pressure cooker, what I love about it, I think I call it the hit it and quit it effect. Right. Because you can literally hit a button, the timer with this knob, you know, what it is that you want to cook and walk away. But this particular soup is amazing. It's a pumpkin curry coconut soup. Oh, it's amazing. It's so aromatic. Um, and I top it off with toasted coconut and... Um, toasted pumpkin seeds, which is, oh my gosh, this wasn't even, with to, uh, toasted coconut and toasted um, pumpkin seeds. And it looks like this particular soup up here. So good. And you can get all these recipes in your book. Yeah, for sure. And then this last one is a butternut squash and tarragon soup. It Speaking is my divine. language right now. So all of these, Aaron, are done in less than 20 to 25 minutes, which is ideal because with the chili in particular, when you've got whole tomatoes, yes. it can take a long time Ooh. to break down. Bren, we're yes. running out of time. So we got to say goodbye, get <laughs> to, back to the couch, but get her book, check out these recipes. We'll save you a 